When it all feels like everything's impossible and you don't fit right in a crowd, go out and break the mold. If you don't try, you'll never fly. But you gotta be brave. Say you're out of luck, knock down in the dumps You got a fragile heart, I know, cause so do I Yeah, stuck here struggling, harder to believe that Things may fall apart, you can't give up the fight Yeah, sometimes running out low, takes you all the way home Prove how far you can go Uh, my first impression when I came to my would be um, I was quite shocked when we first came down from the bus yeah because uh, the scenery here was quite peaceful and calm yeah, yeah. too calm yeah because uh, it was kind of different from what we expected mm. um, to be living overseas where uh, most universities would be like hectic yeah. lots of students mm. but when we reached uh, it was cold cool yeah it was so green with yeah. lots of trees yeah. and with the sky, the grey skies. Yeah, yeah, we were so excited and with the seniors welcoming us, and we were quite excited because we'll be starting our new journey here. Yeah, um, I saw Majan as a very small college that, like, it is not like other big universities in UK. But then after three years, I realized that um, less is actually more. So I really love Majan. I really going to miss Majan, yeah. especially the lecturers, the staff here. They're so lovely. They're so supportive. Uh. When it all feels like everything's impossible and you don't think right, in a crowd go out and break the mold. <laughs> Can I just say that um, I started this course with a bunch of strangers and I finished this course hopefully with a bunch of friends and some of them has become so close that I, I, I don't know what I would do without them. So. Leslie, awesome. Leslie, awesome. We are Leslie. Leslie. Tracy, she's our mother to us. She's the 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 mother to us
the best opportunity to actually get to know you. And I did get to know you all. Um, okay, if you tested me on your names, I know I'd still get some of them wrong. But I do know you all. And um, I just want to thank you for being a fabulous group to teach. Uh, you, you were always, always pleasant, always optimistic. You know, very, very rarely in bad form. Um, occasionally sleepy, but that's okay, because our classes are usually 9 o'clock in the morning, so, you know, sleepy's alright. Um, I don't really have any words of wisdom, I suppose, that I haven't already bored you to tears with in class. But the main thing that I just want to say is enjoy what you do. Um, go into class every day and love it. Um, because if you don't, you know, what's the point? Yeah, I, I do think you, you have to find some part of that you love. And it, it might take a while because you will be nervous in the beginning and maybe um, anxious and possibly a bit excited as well. But, you know, you will get you will gain, gain in confidence. And I think with that confidence, you will start to kind of fit nicely into, into your role as teachers. And I do think you will all make really good teachers. Um, each of you has something very special to offer your students and remember that because at some point you were that student you were sitting in a classroom with a teacher who was trying to inspire you and I think that it's your turn give back now and inspire your students Thank you uh, expectations people in Malaysia are going to have expectations of you you are the uh, England educated, you are the ones coming back from Mahjong, the ones uh, on which the government has spent a lot of money, so uh, many uh, great things uh, may be expected of you from the people around you, and they may be very disappointed when they find out that you don't necessarily have answers to all their problems. Uh, so you're going to have to manage that. Um, I think as well, when you go back into Malaysian schools, when you go back into Malaysian environments, uh, you want to try and blend in uh, as painlessly as possible. So don't stand out too much. Don't, don't insist on being too different from everybody else. And um, I would never have noticed it, but uh, somebody said to me, don't go to school with those expensive bags. Um, something for you to think about there. Uh, my, my experience of watching uh, teachers uh, in classroom for the first time, very, very interesting because when I knew uh, the students here in Plymouth, I knew them as students, not as teachers. And uh, being a good participant on a, in a module doesn't mean that you're going to make a great teacher. But the things that I saw, I saw lots of good teaching and I saw some areas for people to uh, think about. And uh, one of those is uh, classroom management. So you're going to have to make sure that everybody's listening to you every time you speak. Make sure everybody's with you and following you and not uh, paying attention to some, something else. Uh, time management. When you're teaching a lesson that runs over two periods, you've got to make sure that you reach the, the end. You've got to reach some kind of outcomes and results uh, before the end of the period and not just let things drift and then run out of time. Um, and the last one is uh, economy of effort. Don't spend hours and hours preparing beautiful uh, hand cut out uh, decorated uh, drawings and posters and, and objects to stick on the, uh, the board at the front of the class unless you're going to make lots of use of them in the classroom. Okay, you're not, you're not a conjurer, uh, you're not on television. Uh, every time you take something into the class, get the maximum benefit from using it, or as I like to say, less is more. Uh, anyway, um, it's an exciting moment for you, you're going to be starting a new career, uh, going back to the life you once knew, uh, it's going to be very interesting, very exciting for you, and I look forward maybe to seeing you next year when you're out in the schools, so all the very best for me, good luck. Okay, thanks to everybody, it's been a great um opportunity to work with you all uh, and um, it's really been an enjoyable uh, year I think this last year when I've had more chance to, uh, to teach with you and to spend time with you I've really enjoyed it and thanks so thanks a lot for that it's been really fantastic I, I just wanted to say particularly something about the dissertations because um, I thought people worked really hard this year on the dissertations and um, 
I was really impressed at how uh, everybody managed to sort of find a way to express themselves through the dissertation. So that every single dissertation was was very personal and said something about you uh, and who you are and what you're interested in. So well done. We really, um, we're marking and looking at them now, and each of them uh, really demonstrates something about your hard work and your uh, your character and, and the differences between you. It's it's a real pl pleasure to look through those. Um, I'd like to give a little piece of advice actually about teaching. Uh, you know, I get you get lots of little bits of advice, I guess, as you go along the path. But what I would say to you, uh, maybe this is about me, but maybe it will apply to you as well. I don't know. Is that um, it's about teaching for me is about developing a relationship with a group of people, and sometimes it's actually it takes time. So uh, you don't have to to necessarily uh, hit it off with a group of students straight away. It's how you develop and uh, and how the the class merges and bonds and comes together over a period of time and it's the greatest pleasure of a teacher I think to, to, to generate that connection between yourself and the students and to see them developing connections with each other too. It's one of the real sort of uh, joys of being a teacher. Uh, so I think it's something to bear in mind. I would like to wish everybody who I've worked with and from the, both of the Malaysian groups um, all the best for their future teaching careers. Um, I, it's been for me. It's been a real learning experience working with you guys. Um, you know, I first I can remember feeling really nervous the first time I went in um, to work with with one of the groups. And um, you've always been just so welcoming and enthusiastic and really, you know, we've had some really interesting discussions about learning and teaching and about other things as well. Um, so I'm really grateful to you for making my, my time at Marjon a very um, positive and interesting and exciting experience. I'm sure that all of you are going to be great when you get a real class of students in front of you and you um, you know are able to put into practice all the stuff that we've been we've been exploring in these sessions so all the very best to you I wish you everything positive for the for the future and I hope I'll see you again either in Malaysia or somewhere in, in Plymouth possibly all the very best yeah come down Plymouth for maybe a work placement or a sporting event me and Scotty challenge you to football, badminton, football, netball, fight, anything. Whatever you got, bring it on. We'll be there. It's yeah, been yeah. a pleasure working with you lot. Yeah. Um, I'm going to miss you. So I'll be able to Malaysia to see you. So get your badminton kit ready. And get your football boots on. Yeah. On there. Sweet <laughs> chip there. Marjon is fun and you can always joke around and still learn something from it. So, Marjon is impossible to forget. Marjon is where I belong. Marjon is the apple of my eyes. Marjon is where good memories lie. Marjon is the world. Marjon is home. Marjon is our first love. Best place to study. Marjon is the best teaching college ever exists in the world. Marjon is colorful. Marjon is simple but complete. Marjon is where I learn about friendship. Marjon is primal. Marjon is stable. Marjon is home and family. Marjon is. Marjon is excitement. And they get better. Take a breath, take it off, and say. Top of the world, but hey, here's what you say. You might work, but I work harder. You might fight, but I fight smarter. Might not be on top of the world, but hey, I'm on my way. You might fly, but I fly higher. Get so hot, but I'm on fire. Might not be on top of the world, but hey, I'm on my way. Much love to you, Malaysians. Much love. Hopefully see you soon. Peace out. You're part of my car family now. With all my friends and my sisters. Take it easy. <laughs>
Uh, it's bus, it's very <laughs> country. Oi, are we recording? Saya ingin minta. Okay. Marjorie. 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 Okay.